Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Essence of Shay. Let's get started. How you doing? How you living? How you feeling? How you smelling? I just came out the shower so I smell good. Don't come for me. I'm joking. So in this video, I will be talking about the importance of resting. Yo, locks. So y'all know that I've been here for a little over a month. When this video comes out, it'll probably be a little over a month. And I didn't have any of my products, kid. None of them were here. My hair was dry. It was crunchy. Shorty ain't had a brush. All she had was her silk cap. But I thought this would damage my locks, but in all honesty, it did not do any of that. I found that resting my hair, like not putting any products in it, not styling it, not doing anything it, to it, actually helped it to get thicker again from the root, which helps with when the lock actually grows, this is gonna help the thickerization to go throughout the whole lock. So that was pretty dope. I noticed that. Also, the point of resting your hair is to low manipulate it, and that's what I did. I did not do anything to my hair. The most that I would do is put it up in a bun, like y'all see now, but that would be it. I, would, I didn't have nothing to spray on top of it. I didn't have my lavender hair spritz. I didn't have my covered oil. I didn't have a brush to brush it or anything. All I would do is shake my hair out, put some water in my hand, put it like on the top part so it could lay flat and just keep it moving. And it actually surprisingly helped my locks out because I was like, wow. Not after I went and washed my hair and I actually retwisted my hair with just water um, and that came out really good. Um, it's still pretty decent. It's not as rough as it was looking. So yeah, after I did that and I washed my hair and realized that, yo, my hair is actually pretty healthy. Like, it's the healthiest it's been in a while. Like, in a, like a couple months, it's the healthiest it's been because I ain't do so much stuff to it. I literally did not do anything. And it's been a month since I did nothing to my hair. So that just proves to me that it is okay sometimes to just leave your hair alone and not do anything to it. Yes, keep it moisturized. Yes, yes, that is a necessity. But you really don't have to. Like for more, if it's more than a month, then I would say yes. But my thing, what I noticed in my hair is that when I just left it alone and let it do, do what it has to do, it grew, it got thicker, and the sebum, the natural sebum in my hair helped the roots to get a little bit of moisturization, not a whole ton, but it was there. The purpose of making your hair rest is to just give your, your locks a chance to live. That's like if you're sleeping, sis, and you've been working 16 hour shifts all week, and you finally get a day off, sis, and you go to sleep, hun, and you're trying to sleep, and then somebody comes in there, and your boyfriend wakes you up. King, what you doing? leave me alone i'm trying to sleep right that's how your locks feel it needs its time to rest stop waking it up with all this manipulation and all this spraying and all this oil and all this everything give it a chance so i urge you i urge you to give yourself let's say two weeks of not doing anything to your hair no products no styles no nothing just two weeks. Comment in the description box below after two weeks and tell me what happened with your hair. I would like to know because it might not work for everybody else, but this is good to do research so people know, does stuff like this actually work? For me, it did. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't worry about my background. There's nothing there yet. Anyways, Tiger Lilies, see you later. Two. Crash course. Let me have the money in the dashboard.
Max Mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche? Goofy with the curb.